my job was to walk ahead of everybody with a valent, which is a metal detector, and try and identify IEDs in the ground, which are explosive devices. Jason Smith says he found one IED and was collecting data when he stepped on another one. He lost both of his legs in the blast, and he had several other injuries as well. I immediately lost the left, and then the right came off soon after. The blast that changed his life happened more than seven years ago. A lot's happened over those years. He got married. He now has two children. You know, the ups definitely outweigh the downs. I met my wife after I was injured. So um, in a weird way, the bomb was the best thing that ever happened to me. Um, I've met so many great people out of it. I have two beautiful children after the injury. And um, it's just like I wouldn't change anything. We met up with Jason at a Goji House of Iron on Hickson Pike. Jason and another wounded veteran from the war in Afghanistan, Matt Leva, showed us some of the ways they're able to work out despite their injuries. Jason says he feels the pain from his injuries all the time. The pain that I endure walking or the pain that I endure in the gym is, is uh, easier for me to handle than the pain of me just sitting at home feeling sorry for myself and not doing anything. I set the limits for my body. I don't let my injuries set the limits for me. And through fitness, it's given me an outlet uh, to be you know, physically and mentally fit. His time spent in the gym has led him to a new job with an organization called Catch a Lift. Their goal is to help veterans stay active. We don't just cater to like, you know, catastrophic wounded veterans yeah. but you know any veteran 40% uh, if they have a 40% uh, disability rating through the VA, then we offer them free gym membership and free gym equipment. Right now, the program is for post 9-11 veterans, but they hope to expand it to other veterans in the future. Jason says the goal is just to help the people who have sacrificed so much for our country. We want to help you. We, we want to make sure you're okay. You're not forgotten. Um, we aren't an organization that gives you something and disappears. We're an organization that lets you set the goals for yourself. And we make sure that you reach those goals. And there is much more to the Catch a Lift story and what the organization offers. You can find a link to the Catch a Lift website in this story on our website, newschannel9.com.